What you can see here is an object detection live stream with up to 70 frames per second. We are using a pre-trained model which can recognize common objects such as people, chairs, bottles and so on. And all of it is processed on this small device, Google's new Coral Dev Board. Pretty incredible, right? But how did we get here? Some years ago, machine learning was mainly run on big devices. But recently, more and more edge and mobile devices are equipped with processing chips which are especially made for computing neural networks. An early edge device was the Movidius Neural Compute Stick from Intel, which was released in September 2016 and was already capable of running neural networks in real time. But as you can see in our video from back then, the frames per second it achieved were quite low. Now Google has just released the Coral Dev Board and it promises a 10 times faster inference time compared to the Movidius Stick. So what is the Coral Dev Board and why is it so much better? You can think of it as a Raspberry Pi on steroids. What makes it so powerful is its Edge TPU, which stands for Tensor Processing Unit, a special processor developed by Google. Until recently, GPUs used to be the preferred processor behind deep learning applications because of their parallel processing capabilities. Though they are general purpose processors and have to support many different applications. TPUs, in contrary, are optimized for running machine learning models and therefore offer better performance over GPUs. And the Edge TPU is only a fraction of the size of a penny. So what can you be using it for? Basically for any application that requires high performance computer vision as well as a small footprint and energy efficiency. Your models have to be converted to TensorFlow Lite, because this is the only framework the device supports. You also have to stick to Python at the moment, but Google wants to release support for C++ soon. What would you do with the Coral Dev Board? Comment below and let us know. Also check out their demos we linked in the description below that help you to get started. And now have fun experimenting, thanks for watching and see you next time.